Let's go to Virtue Field. UVM seeking its first win in conference play, hoping that would come against the Binghamton Bearcats. Third quarter is where we'll start. UVM up by a score. Rob Hudson has room, and he's just going to take it in himself. The Bearcat defense missing in action. UVM takes a 6-4 lead. Minute and a half later, Joe Licata serves it in. Will Talbot Shear puts it home, and the Bearcats, Bearcats cut the deficit in half just like that. Fourth quarter. UVM up two, Binghamton still hanging around. Thomas McAndrew fires upper 90. He finds pay dirt, and the Catamounts still clinging to a one-goal lead. UVM offense would find its stride. Ian McKay, a nice look to Hudson, who buries it from distance, his fourth score of the day. Then three minutes later, they keep it rolling, working the ball around to Dawes Milchling, who connects near post for the score. A three-goal game. Less than two minutes later, Milchling works his way around the goalie, who is now out of position. This ain't Staples, but that was easy. Goal ties a bow on the afternoon. Catamounts pick up their first America East win of the season. 10-6, you're fine. It was a good win at home, and we don't have many home games, so it was nice to win today. Uh, and uh, last year didn't go as planned when we, when we played Binghamton, and, and today it was nice to get the win get back in the win column in the American East. It was really important, I think, for our guys to see that all the hard work's, you know, continuing to pay off. Uh, last week was, you know, a really tough game against the number one team, and this, this week was also a tough game, but I thought we showed a lot of uh, resiliency to stick with it, stick with the game plan, and pull out the win against a tough Binghamton team. Chris Fifes and the Cats will look to make it two in a row when they travel to Hartford next Saturday. Sticking at Sunny Virtue Field, same two teams, same place, only the women this time. Weird situation right out of the gate. Check this out. UVM keeper tagged with a penalty, so Callan Williams gets to shoot from the free position without a keeper in the net. I've never seen that before. Little weird situation. one nothing Binghamton later. The keeper back in the net this time, but it doesn't matter for Jacqueline Kennedy, who doubles the Bearcats' lead 2 to nothing. Three minutes later, Cats get on the board. Elise Cole. Shot fakes once, then puts it home. Vermont tallies its first score of the day, two to one. But the Bearcats had the answer. Sky Schumacher fires low while falling low, all the way to the ground. That caps a Binghamton two goal spurt, four one. Cats respond, Mackenzie Bolt zips her way through the defense, just beats the whistle for the score. Vermont makes it a two goal game, but that's as close as the Cats would get. Binghamton leaves with a W, 15 to eight. <laughs> 